Hi everyone, I'm Teacher Diane and welcome to Mathematics for Young and Intelligent Minds with Maryville Education Center. This series is for grade 5 and it talks about the properties of quadrilaterals. Are you ready? Great! Let's learn some vocabulary words. Here are some important words for this lesson. Can you say them with me? Here we go. Quadrilateral. Quadrilateral. Square. Square. Rectangle. Rectangle. Rhombus. Rhombus. Parallelogram. Parallelogram. Trapezium. Trapezium. Kite. Height. That's great. Now, let's learn more about the types of quadrilateral. First, we have to know what is quadrilateral. Please say the word with me. Quadrilateral. Good. Quadrilateral can be defined as a closed, two-dimensional shape with just four straight sides. In this video, we're going to learn about the six types of quadrilateral and its properties. Let us start with square. Can you repeat the word? Square. Very good. So what are the properties of square? A square has four right angles. Right angles measures exactly 90 degrees. A square has four equal sides. Meaning, if one side measures 5 centimeters, all sides are 5 centimeters. A square has two pairs of parallel sides. Line segment BC is parallel to its opposite side AB, and line segment DA is parallel to its opposite side CD. The next type of quadrilateral is rectangle. Can you repeat after me? Rectangle. Fantastic! So what are the properties of a rectangle? A rectangle has four right angles, same like square. The opposite sides of rectangle are equal in length. A rectangle has two pairs of opposite sides that are parallel. Line segment DC is parallel to line segment AB, and line segment AD is parallel to line segment CD. Excellent! Let's go to our next quadrilateral. Now we go to rhombus. Can you repeat after me? Rhombus. Fantastic! So what are the properties of a rhombus? Rhombus is same like square in terms of sides. All the sides of the rhombus are equal in length. It also has two pairs of parallel sides. The difference between a square and a rhombus are the angles. Square has a right angles, but rhombus doesn't have a right angle. But the opposite angles of rhombus are equal with each other. Angle B is equals to angle D. Angle A is equals to angle C. Great! Next is parallelogram. Can you repeat after me? Parallelogram. That's great, boys and girls. So what are the properties of a parallelogram? If rhombus is same like square in terms of the side length, parallelogram is same like a rectangle. Only the opposite sides are equal in length and are parallel with each other. The opposite angles of parallelogram are equal. Angle A is equal to angle C. Angle B is equal to angle D. The fifth type is trapezium. Can you repeat after me? Trapezium. Fantastic! So what are the properties of trapezium? Trapezium has one pair of parallel sides. Line segment BC is parallel to line segment AD. 
The sum of angles between the pair of the parallel sides is 180 degrees. Angle A and angle D is equal to 180 degrees and angle C and angle D is equals to 180 degrees. Awesome! The last type of quadrilateral is kite. Can you repeat after me? Kite. Excellent. So what are the properties of kite? Unlike all quadrilateral in which they have parallel sides, kite doesn't have parallel sides. Instead, kite have two pairs of adjacent sides which are equal in length. When we say adjacent, these are sides that share the same vertex. Another characteristic of kite is that it has a pair of opposite angles that is equal in measurement. Angle A is equal to angle C. Perfect! Now we're done with the properties of quadrilaterals. Now, let's check your learning. Let's identify and compare the four quadrilaterals. What do you call this shape again? Very good. It is a square. How about this shape? Excellent. It's a rhombus. What properties are the same in square and rhombus? Good. All the sides of the square and rhombus are equal. So, what is the difference between the two quadrilateral? The difference are their angles. Square has four right angles, while the angles of rhombus are not right angles. Awesome! Let us try another one. How about this shapes? Excellent. It is a rectangle and a parallelogram. What properties are the same in a rectangle and a parallelogram? Rectangle and parallelogram are the same because only the opposite sides are equal in length. So, what is the difference between the two quadrilateral? The difference are their angles. Rectangle has four right angles, while the angles of the parallelogram are not a right angle. Awesome! Hope you understand our lesson. Happy learning, students! I hope that you understand our lesson. See you on our next episode.